Hello friends and welcome to today's video of Night in the Woods. I know my hair is quite a drastic change from what it was yesterday and I do apologize for how late this video is going up. I have literally only just got home myself. In the year granddad died. Oh gosh, this is already set off to a very like deep and dark setting. We had the worst flood since 1999. The highway extension came with the Oh, so I can choose. Uh, we had the worst flood since 1998. I said 1999. I wasn't meant to say that. Greg got trapped on top of a doghouse. The power was out for two days. Casey Hartley came by in his dad's boat. And I laughed when I saw him. Grandad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories. And quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. They feared death in their wings in their trees. They went looking for the gods. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with uh, in their wings in their trees all things die be at peace on his last day he sat up suddenly and stared bug eyed through the window at the old parking locks at the old empty hill at the old trains let's, let's go with old playground because it's a little bit creepy then half washed away he turned to my dad eyes still wide this house is haunted, he said, and died. Okay, that's not weird at all. <laughs> Dead man tells you that the house is haunted. Okay, cool. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. Welcome home, May. Okay, so... Hi, can I talk to you? Oh, that's my space bar. Excuse me, but where is everybody? It's 10.45. It's closed. Not a lot of folks get off the last bus in Possum Springs these days. Just you. Okay. Isn't there supposed to be someone at the desk? So are you the janitor or something? I'm going to go with this one. Closed. Why are the lights on? Why is the TV on? It's spooked. I get spooked when I'm here by, by my lonesome. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Um, okay, so I am aware I've got to do voices. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to do for the voices so far. Wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs has never looked more uh, falsely advertised. I kind of want to give her like that sassy kind of like voice. It must be a self-relief to pay... F self relief Relief to pay pay phone companies that Possum Spring gets zero cell reception. It'd be cool to call my parents. But some jerk hole took the time to actually rip it off. Who steals a phone? Trust me, you'd be surprised. For Sarko Fox, you are too dreamy. Can I leave? Can I not leave? Oh, was I meant to watch that? I have no idea what I'm doing already. I'm already so far, like, gone. Can I squeeze past you? Nope, just broke the damn thing. When did you think it would be done? Right after you go grab me a fascicola from the machine. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice. Free as in free? Free as in no one... No one's here to say otherwise. Okay, so he's rigged it, so it's free. Okay, I was gonna say. What the? They have a lime Fasako and he wants a Fasako cola? That's just a waste. Get one yourself then. Okay, just gotta grab it. Oops. That was Neo. <laughs> I like that. That was that was nice. I'm gonna keep like constantly changing her voice because I'm not gonna always remember what her voice is. One Freya Sagola. Oh yeah, he's got a beak. Forgot about that. Yummers. So what are you doing here? I live here. Well, lived here. Huh. Strange. When do you think that door's gonna be fi finished? Now. Goodbye. Uh, bye. Okay, that was a bit weird. So any like side um 
characters i'm just gonna put my put in my own voice um i am aware that there are other characters here well i'm right outside town mum and dad nowhere to be found dark and cold guess i'm walking alone okay um i don't think the voice i gave her was very good this bus station is maybe the newest thing in possum springs guess they got stunt state funding or something it makes a good first or last impression i suppose if not that f abandoned glass factory back there not getting rid of that anytime soon cool leo wow I didn't realise how much I missed the sound of that train. I used to hear it in my bed at night, during the winter when the leaves were down. Okay. I'm so confused on why she's just like talking about absolutely everything. Well, I guess I'm going to hike through the woods. Through the woods is home. My bed. And my negligent parents. <laughs> maybe, I think maybe like that sassy, sarcastic voice is actually kind of like suits her a little bit. I thought I was gonna die. Huh, this is some dark nature. Dank nature and garbage. Are those food donkey shop shopping carts? That's all the way across town. That's dedication. Is it? There used to be an old sawmill around here, I think. I mean, the park up there is called Sawmill Park. Looks like they lost a log load, a log load at some point. Gonna have to climb this, I guess. Climb. You mean run up? Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Maybe I don't get it. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh my god. That was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. I am not going to die in this hole. <laughs> sure, May. Whatever. Shopping bags are little ghosts of grocery stores haunting everywhere else. Okay, sure. What am I doing? What is my life? <laughs> Murph, <laughs> I saw that. This is going to be as uncut as possible as usual, considering it is a let's play. Um, wow, I haven't been here in maybe 10 years, and apparently no one else has. 2 3. I'm so confused. I don't know what we're. I don't know. I don't know what they're going for here. Some sort of boat castle? Most of it's gone now. Just a, just a thing for weird animals to eat and have babies in. Um. Sure, I guess. Ahoy! Good, good to know. <laughs> Looks like the ladders are gone. If I could just get into the top of this thing. Ugh. I could never make it up onto that tree when I was a kid. The number logs mocked me. The logs and the other kids. Let me see if I can visualise this. Hmm. Can't stop running while I do this. Not even for a second. Gonna have enough, gotta have enough momentum. I think I can do it. One and jump, jump, jump. Okay, turkey. Did it. Yeah, boy. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground. Possum Springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should write it down. Okay, so we get like a little notebook. Oh, R.I.P. Grandad. Oh, your parents forgot you. Okay, so we have options if we need it. Um, Perfect. Ooh, can we just jump along? Because that seems to be quicker. <laughs> just a nice little tight roping as we go. What in the honest bejesus was this even for? Oops. <laughs> just kind of made a drop there for a second. Okay, what was the point in any of that? Oh, I see what the point in that was. Fair enough. <laughs> I gotta do it all again. You're a cat. You're supposed to be. You're supposed to be able to land on your feet. Hello, May. Been a while. 
Hey, what are you doing here? Doing out here? Nothing better to do? I was out here doing my rounds and I saw you in the very off limits playground. So, get in the car, May. No. You want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. <laughs> okay. Ah, so we're home now. Bless this mess. Where am I? Oh, it's, it's cutscene. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hey, remember me? Ah! May, you gave me a heart attack. Good. What are you doing? Oh. May, honey, we thought you were coming tomorrow night. You thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested. By Aunt Moore Cop. Oh, did you say hi to Molly for me? No, I say hi for no one. Ugh, F the cops. <laughs> I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? Ah, oh, May, so good to hear that voice again. Good night. Bless her. Oh. There we go. Okay, so I have to jump up the stairs, do I? The hell is this? There are a few things hanging around in here from the old country. I think that's a county, actually. <laughs> this clock, the trunk in the storage room, and whatever is buried under the house after that cement incident. I'm sorry, cement incident? Ugh. Since when is the crawl space all jammed up? wonder if Dad could move them. Yeah, Dad put them here, I bet. Dad should move them. It's only fair. <laughs> okay, May. <laughs> uh, can I go this way? No, there's nothing that way. Uh, that way is down the stairs, I believe. Yeah. Okay, so I'm assuming up to that door is her parents' place? Or is this my place? Oh, this is so cute. Bless her, she's so cute. I don't know if the voice I gave her was matches her, but I don't know. I feel like she's just a really sarky kind of person, so I just thought I'd give her like that sarky kind of voice, if you know what I mean. Oh, okay, I have to wake her up. Okay, I didn't realise that. <laughs> Relatable. Could play some bass, but which song? Now, later, Space Dragon. Wonder in space. Oh, Wanderer in space. No matter forbidden place. Oh my god, I actually have to play? Ah! <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I don't know what I'm doing. Nope. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> can I leave? Okay, cool. I can. Can I not, like, go to my parents' room? Oh, I can. Okay. How is this bird still alive? Oh, I can't go into that. It was pretty great when Granddad gave me that apple crate of old scary stories. Not sure how they ended up out here. Death comes to Wig Wigglesbury, the fancy corpse. Homo steven... whatever. Necropus... Book the first, Lady Shark, the stoat on Gallows Hill. Were they like Easter eggs or something? It was so cute then. We were so cute then. Cuties, the lot of us. We could have a traveling show. The cute Borowskis. I don't know how to pronounce that surname. Honey. Yeah. Come see me in the kitchen before you leave. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna go see mommy. Hi, Mom. Welcome home, sweetie. Thanks for for not changing the locks. Sorry, we mixed up the day you were coming back. It was such short notice. It's okay, Mom. May, honey. Yeah. Is everything okay? Yeah. What do you mean? Uh, what do you mean? Honey, did something happen? I just needed to come home. Well, sweetie, I think you can understand my worry. 
That's not usually something a college sophomore just up and does. I know. Honey, you can tell me if something happens. Mum, I'm fine, really. We can talk about this another time. Can oh, sorry, can we talk about this another time? Sure, honey, it's okay. Thanks, Mum. I bet your old friends will be happy to see you. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't have, you wouldn't happen to know where Greg is, would you? Oh, honey, Greg's working down at the Snack Falcon, up in the town centre west by the Click Clack. I think I'll run over and say hi. We have a Snack Falcon now? We have a snack. Oh, yeah, it's so handy. You know, ever since the food doggy donkey went out, <laughs> I said doggy, the food donkey is gone. Oh, yeah, going on almost a year now. Wow, wh where does everyone shop? Everyone goes out to the ham panther out by the highway now. But I see your little friend Greg when I go into town. Wow, the food donkey's gone. We have a snack falcon. It's a whole new world, sweetie. A whole new world. <laughs> yes, it is. Well, have a good day out there. Lots to explore. See what's changed. I will. Just watch out for the construction. Well, it wouldn't be full in Possum Springs without loads of construction. It's so festive, honey. I'll be back later. Bye, sweetie. Okay, those voices I mixed up entirely. Right, we have a little mum. That looks older. Okay, so she does, she writes stuff in her notebook, I guess. Part one home again that was the introduction jesus <laughs> gosh okay that was interesting okie dokie right that means i can go back inside can i climb on this i can't the hell why am i able to go oops kill 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 the hell <laughs> okay that was a bit odd right okay i'm i'm, I'm not gonna jump but i'm gonna like keep going across this because I want to see where it goes it's got to lead to somewhere otherwise it wouldn't be up here would it like games games are not really like that see like the camera is panning out a little bit so there must be up here there must be something up here to the point I'm going into a whole new section as well <laughs> she do that while she was up there I hope you guys are not fussed with me doing this. <laughs> oh. This is so weird. Like, why am I able to go up this far? There's actually a thing up here? Why, why can the squirrel do it? Oh, I was going to say. I was going to say, why can the squirrel do it and I can't? That's so unfair. Why am I able to do this? What the hell? Is there even someone up here? Absolutely no one. It's a good thing I can't die. <laughs> Wait, do I have full damage in this? I can imagine I do, but I don't know. Okay, so that's how we get down. Okay, right, let's go back. Let's go back to my house, which was there. And I'm going to try and like, explore absolutely everything. Okay. Well, it's sure, sure it is full. All the road work crammed in before winter makes like half the town inaccessible. And I should want to walk the long way round for like 20 minutes. Which, I mean, no. Okay, so I can't get past them. So that's that's that in done, really. <laughs> that was short, sweet and snappy. Mr. Hey, Mr. Twigmeyer. May? Is that you? Sure it is. Nope. Sure it is. Home for a visit? No, I'm home for good. What? They not have college anymore? Nope, I burned it down. Not for me, at least. I always thought you'd do. You'd rather go on to do great things or sit on your ass here until you put it down roots. Ass roots? Guess I can settle that one in my mind. Is he trying to say, see you around? I guess he's trying to say that he knew I was going to be a lazy dick or something. <laughs> Which is not very nice. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Selmers! What are you doing home? Dropped out. Wow. Yeah, I guess. So, like, you just don't go back? That's about it. Weird. So, have you, have you been? Okay. Me and Dennis split. 
Oh no. Yeah, he got a job at the new prison over in Briddle and he met some girl at a gas station. Wow, what a jerk. Yeah, he's a free agent, I guess. What's what's that word they use for like a weapon you make in jail? Like a knife? A shiv? I hope Dennis gets shivved at work. <laughs> Just to scare him. Scare him good. That'll do it. Sure, scare him right in the kidney. Okay, well I gotta go. Nice seeing you. Stop by any time. Uh, yeah, I, that thing I won't be doing. <laughs> My god, she's a bit of a psychopath. Hello. I completely changed her name. What you doing on my porch? Good question. Hey, Mr. Chazakov. Hello, May. My be my worst, best worst student. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Like, the ca constellations hated school. Hey, don't knock school. School is vital for your future. Technically isn't. What are you doing back in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Oh. Well, if you're so interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should I have my new telescope set up by them? Sure thing. The thing is, the way that that just happened, where she was, he was just like, school is vital. And I was like, oh, so what happened to school? Oh, I dropped out. It's like a massive slap in the face. Like, school teaches, school doesn't teach you the vital things that you need to learn. So, like, taxis, um, insurance, um bills, things like that. It doesn't teach you anything valuable that you need in life. Like, honestly, can someone, unless you're a scientist or a mathematician, like, or, you know, it's something like that. Honestly, when have, I, have you ever used algebra since you've come out of school? Like, I've not used it once, like, ever. And I don't plan to. Like, I hated algebra at school. <laughs> and I still do, and I'm not even at school. So, like, sometimes in my eyes, the school teaches you things that, you know, um, that you don't necessarily need to learn. Or that you can learn in your own time if you want to. So, like, history or geography or religious education. Things like that. If you want to learn it in your own time, you should be able to select whether you want to learn those particular topics. And if you don't, then fair enough. You can go learn that in your own time if you really wanted to. But it's just like, I, the one thing that really bothers me about school is how strict the, the curriculum can be. And they'll penalise you for it if you don't succeed. But if you don't have an interest in that particular topic, so like say for me, history is not a subject that I'm massively interested in. It'd only be something that I'd be interested in if I went looking for a particular subject in history. Sorry, topic in history. That because, you know, for arguments like history, you don't do well in it because you're not necess necessarily, like, um, interested in it. That's the word I was looking for. School will penalise you for it. And it's just so stupid. It's just like, well, I'm not interested in it. Why should I have to do something that I don't want to do? Um, I remember when Bayes, 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 <laughs> I remember when Bia's family had a house and not a tiny dressing apartment. Okay, well, I don't remember any of that because I went there for it. Ha ha ha. Oh, in fact, I had to walk all the beside. Hey, it's the Harleys. What are you doing? Little Joe, you're under arrest. Oh, wow. Kids still talk about little Joe? You, We used your DNA. Do you kids know what DNA is? Ghosts don't have DNA. Do you guys know what DNA is? Yeah, it's the stuff you use to solve crimes. Um, I guess you're right. A body part, but really small. There we go. But ghosts don't have parts. At least someone is smart. Yeah, Harley. Harley's right. Hey, lady. Will you go away? Lady? Okay. I've come to realise that I'm using all the same voice for the same, all for the same characters. Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was a freshman. Probably. How's it going? Just lost my job. Oh no! They say construction's always hiring, but it's not. In fact, it's often laying off guys named Dan. What are you doing? What are you going to do? I'm open to suggestions. Don't give up. I'm sure someone in town is in town is hiring. Don't give up. Well, there's always a chance someone will die, and I can have their job. Dan, you're not gonna like kill anyone, are you? Does it pay? 
I'm very slightly concerned for you, actually. Can I talk to you again? Don't have a job either. Oh, man, sorry to talk your ear off about it. How are you holding up? Good. Just dropped out of college and I'm living with my parents. Oh. So you're basically a teenager again. No. I'm just an adult living with her parents. Uh, okay, so it's not like you're unemployed. It's like you're lacking a daytime hobby. The pay that pays you that pays money you don't need rent for. What? Alright, I'm gonna get going. Yeah. Alright, smart ass smart ass Dan. <laughs> Telling me what my life is. Okay, can I go down here? What's down here? There's so much to explore, oh my god. I have no idea where I am. Usually someone's fishing here for the tunnel fish because why the hell not? The tunnel flooded and we lost a bit more land to the fish. <laughs> Is that bad? How are you working down here? Hey, I just got back in town and the one thing I missed most was, hey, I remember you. Hello. Thief? Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Alright, you know what? I'm not a thief. You take that back. This isn't even a restaurant. It's it's a crappy food stand in a hole. This establishment has been in business for 50 years. 50 crappy years in a hole. You know what else has been in a hole for 50 years? Dead people from the 60s. <laughs> no respect. No respect this one. You can keep your whole pretzels and your damp pyrogies. Pyrogies? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. But that was mean. Delicious pretzels. Can I not stick? Can I not nick one? I want to nick one again just to rub you up the wrong way. <laughs> I don't know why I want to do that. Hey, dudes. How we doing? Hey, teens. Hey. What you guys doing? Not much, apparently. Nothing. <laughs> cool. Cool that people still hang around he down here. We used to do that when I was in high school. Yeah. I wasn't in high school that long ago, you know. How old are you? 20. Oh, so you can't buy beer? No. Do you have a car? No. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> um... I don't know, I don't know about this, but I know some, like, places in America you can't drink unless you're, like, 21. In fact, I think that's America's rule anyway. You have to be, like, 21 to be able to, like, um, drink. Right, okay, I skipped a whole load of town there because I decided to go into this tunnel. <sighs> oh, I'm so sorry. I'm really tired. It's, like, half past one in the morning and I'm really tired. <laughs> I only got home, like... Not that long ago as well. Okay, so if I go up here and go to the left, PS missing possum springs, more like awesome springs. Okay, right, so missing. Casey Hartley, 19, of Possum Springs, last week, see, sorry, last seen at dusk on June the 27th, walking westward along the tracks behind the former food donkey. He was wearing a black hooded sweatshirt, jeans, and black canvas shoes. If any information as to the location of Casey Hartley at any time since his last knowing, please contact the Possum Springs Police Department immediately. Can I take this? Okay, well, that's just patronising. Why would you leave this here? Oh, because she's a cat. Yeah. Harvest. Possum Springs annual harvest spectacular. Wow. Celebrate the fools, full colours with your neighbours. Rides, contests, food, games, and the annual crazy costume parade. October 21st to the 24th, Town Centre. Sponsored by the Possum Springs Chamber of Commerce. Blessed Rest, rest, blessed rest Funeral Parlour. Sorry, I don't know why I paused at that. Catros... Cat Tarossa and Catarossa attorneys and Ham Panther. Okay. <laughs> Where have I about? Right, I can't talk to you. Can I go up the stairs? No, I can't. My god, what kind of weather did I miss? This is nuts. Oh well, wasn't going to church anyway. <laughs> Fair enough. 
Thought this place was falling apart. Oh, thought this place is falling apart. Okay, I get it now. Eat pocket. Okay, fair enough. So I can't talk to you. What? And where exactly are you planning on going? I don't know, Ham Panther? But honey, you're only going to get minimum there. And I hear they're, they're murder. This place is murder. I don't think I can handle one more incoming call. I wake up sometimes hearing because I hear that bing noise. Nowadays, I just take a sleeping aid whilst wanders. We shouldn't have to drag ourselves to get to sleep from this job. Or Ham Panther isn't going to give you a bonus. Ham Panther doesn't even have a leaderboard. But it isn't, but it isn't calls. It isn't sales. I wouldn't be waiting for that bing. I don't know, honey. Maybe you'll have a good shift today and get on the leaderboard. And we'll see how you feel then. I guess. But it won't change anything. Is she saying she wants cigarettes and he wants a cup of tea or something? I have no idea. Harvest sale. What is this? Okay, let me talk to you. Hey, killer. Uh, don't call me that. Who are you? Laurie M. How do you even know about the killer thing? It was a big deal even to us middle schoolers. Uh, well, that was a long time ago. And what did the middle schoolers say? Okay, we'll go with this one. You put him in the hospital. And no one knows why. Did he, like, have it coming or something? No. Well, mother's told us not to talk to you. Because no one knew when you were going to do it again. Well, say hi to your mother for me. She sounds lovely. Oh, she's gone. Oh, sorry. It's fine. Yeesh. R.I.P. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, cool. I think I have a great, great uncle or something on this. Yep, there you go. Anselm Borowski. Anselm? Even in life, he was tragic. How would you even know? You've never met him. Big skeleton. What the hell? Okay, cool. Whatever. Um, party barn. Right, okay, let's just, let's just go this way and see what's this way. And then, actually, hold on. Can I go into that shop? I can't even remember. Because I was thinking, if I can go into that shop, then I don't really need to, like, worry about the rest of the... Uh, worry about coming back. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> oh, silly me. <clears throat> oh, what's this? Two. Is that, like, two? Or, or like... Also, this is an error so bad, even I wouldn't make it. Um, sure. Okay, can't go in there. Can't go in there. Okay, that's the other end of the tunnel. Can I go up here? Hey guys, can I talk to you? It's almost five, quitting time. Kick back some brews and watch the smelters. Millers. Don't like the sound of that place. Oh, snack falcon. Okay, so a guy called Greg is supposed to be in there? And that house is somewhat abandoned. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Click, clack, dinner. Diner. Dinner. <laughs> Can't even read now. Don't think I'm going to find Greg out by the abandoned food donkey. Better head snack falcon woods. Words. 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 Woods. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> oh, God, I'm so tired. I think I'll see Greg and then I think I'll call it because I'm getting really tired. <laughs> oh. Is that Greg? Oh my god. Hey Greg. What are you doing here? Okay, I need to figure out another voice because I'm back. <sighs> I don't know what voice to give him. Like a happy go lucky, like really bubbly for the. Like back as in today? Back as in back. Too bad you didn't die at college. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda accident. God, it's good to see you. Ah! <laughs> How's Angus? You two still a thing? Hold on. What are you doing? Changing the music! <laughs> what? Angus! What are you doing here? I live here. Since when? Since last night. 11 or so? 
That's amazing. Come to band practice. Why have I given him the same voice? Oh my god, the band is still a thing. Sure. What's when's practice? Now. When did you get off work? Now. <laughs> really? Yeah, apparently so. Ah, <laughs> he's screaming. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, who's this guy? Greg rules, okay. <laughs> Whatever you say, Sammy. Hi, Angus. Hey, it's you. It's me! It's me. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. So the party bomb went out, huh? Yeah. Not sure how it ever, ever stayed open. Like, how many parties are there, really? You need a lot of parties to keep a barn running. I have your old base! Oh, dude, I don't think I even remember. Huh, hey, Bay. Uh, May's back. Wow, hi. Yeah, hi. She's totally back! Wait, what? No, oh, what voice can I give her? Because I've given Angus and Bay like, the same voice at the minute. So, like, if I go with, like... Oh, if I give Bay like, the boring voice that I've given Angus, because she looks like that kind of like, oh my god, what am I doing here? <laughs> like that, that kind of person. And Angus looks more like nerdy, but like sort of together, if that makes any sense. Oh, I'll think of something. Right, okay, I don't know why I grabbed hold of my mouse. Are you uh, here for band practice? I play drums. That's not drums. That's computer. It's fine. She also does your bass parts. I don't know if that's going to fit. Well, I understood them as the bass parts, but I can turn them off. Turn them off on your computer? May, you're totally going to play a song. You totally have to play bass. I don't even remember. Those aren't even drums. Oh, for flip's sake. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Is there lyrics going down at the bottom there? Because I'm not going to read them. I can't do two things at once. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. In them like whenever they throw in a two I'm like I don't know what I'm doing I'm actually gonna be here for like a whole three minutes I'm sorry, you're throwing twos at me. I don't know what to, I don't I don't know how to cope with twos. Oh apparently I do. <laughs> it sounds like a rocking song, not even gonna lie. Dude, she, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. I don't know how to deal. I don't. I'm actually doing this for a whole three minutes. Are you seriously kidding me? I didn't know seeing Greg would turn into this. Ow, my wrist. Ow. Wow, May, that was a. Uh... Pretty bad is what it was. 
I literally do not know this song. Holy crap. That was hard to do. Sorry, I'm oh I'm mixing up all their voices. We'll get back in practice. We'll get back in practice. I hope. Jeez. My wrist hurts. So does mine. <laughs> That was great, man. Like, just seeing you back. Playing your old, horrible bass. Okay. Are we doing this diner thing? Yeah! Woo! Yay. <laughs> hip, hip. <laughs> okay. Mmm. Hell yeah. Do you miss pizza, pay May? They have pizza at school. Oh, cool. Oh, shit. I don't, I don't know how to do. This pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Dudes, have you, have, haven't you heard of this pizza scale? The what? Screw it, pizza good. <laughs> the what? There's a scale of pizza. On one end, there's the worst pizza. But like everything right above that is still really good. What's at the other end of the scale? It's pizza all the way up. Pizza, good. I mean, it's n no pastabilities. Um, mm, I missed pastabilities. I mean, uh, I am not touching those crusts. Same. We should have gone to pastabilities. The diner has ambience. The seats are comfy. The food is terrible, but it's got charm. You too fancy for the diner now? Guys, please. I was raised in this diner. You and like a zillion rats. Well, that was a very nice. Jesus. So when are we going to go? When are we going to play out? <laughs> May, we don't play out. Oh, we have jobs, May. I don't work at the video output. I work at the out. I work at the video outpost too. I'm at the old pick pickaxe. I thought you guys were going to school. Isn't that your dad's store? I thought you guys were going to school. Eh. Yeah, well, life happens. I'm Lord of the Snack Falcons. <laughs> I love Greg. Where's Casey? Oh yeah, you wouldn't Oh yeah, you wouldn't know, huh? Casey's gone. Gone? Gone how? We looked at the we looked at the leaflet. They've gone missing. Hop to train, I bet. Oh wow. He always talked about doing that. Yeah, one day he was just gone. Made a clean break, hasn't emailed or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters, but everyone knew what happened. Jeez. Casey, I Ugh. Mm hmm And what exactly do you do, May? I was in college, and why exactly are you not still there? Man, screw school, didn't work out. Huh, imagine that. She's got it out for me, hasn't she? Like, does she not like me or something? Well, we better get home, dude. Oh yeah, Angus got a date with sword people online. Sword people online. <laughs> sword art online. <laughs> oh, lucky. It's sword people online. I love it. <laughs> it's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day. Oh my god. Holy crap. What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Oh my god, there's an arm on the floor. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first. Why is there an arm on the floor? I... I Mate, this is like tampering with evidence. Ugh, I'm going to have to start worrying about getting dismembered on my way home. Shh, I wanna touch, I wanna watch this. You don't need to watch, you don't need your ears to watch. Shh. This is mildly disturbing. Like, why am I doing this? Can I not, like, stop or something? Do I have to get, like, in a certain position or something? Like, I'm just poking this goddamn arm. Like, can I not? 
do this, please? <laughs> now, what's going on here? Uh-oh. So I just had to poke it for a random amount of time. Okay. Hey, um, Molly, we found an arm. All right, May, put the stick down and step away from the arm. All right, all right, don't taste me or anything. No promises. Oh, well, I think it's time for Angus and I to get home. See you tomorrow, May. All right, I don't want any of you walking home alone tonight. Buddy system, something bad's going on. I can drive May home, officer. Thank you, Bay. Bay, beer? Yeah, thanks, beer. Let's roll. Okay, I'm gonna gonna get back home and then I'm gonna switch this off. Well, isn't this exciting? So, working at the old pickaxe. Yeah. Are you... Are they training you to take over the family business? They... Um, your parents? Hey, look, we're here. Oh, my house actually isn't for a few blocks. Get out. Okay. Uh, thanks for the ride. Go. Is her parents dead or something? Okay, I'm gonna leave it. No, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna get her to bed and then and then we'll see. Hey, hey, kitten. Wow. Listen, May. I'm sorry about last night. I really thought you were coming home tonight. It's okay. It's okay, I guess. No, it's okay. Went through the reverend by the old mill. Almost died. What? Yeah, logs almost killed me. Normal stuff. Well, I promise you, promise you'll never leave you stranded again. Tell you what, how about we pretend I did come home tonight and we just got, we just got back from the bus station. Start over? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, May. Thanks for picking me up. You're welcome. Welcome home, May. I'm going to go to sleep, I think. Well, you've had a big day. Good night, kitten. <laughs> cute. That's really cute. Right, okay, so... Um, still funny though. <laughs> Die anywhere, RIP my bass playing. Oh my god, there's so much like stuff she's written. Gosh, I know, I know it did come up in the in the corner of the of the screen. I just didn't want to like disturb it or anything. So, yeah, I think this is it. This is gonna be the last bedtime. Yes, please. Because even I need to get to bed. <laughs> so this is the first episode of Night in the Woods. Um, by the time you see my next video tomorrow, uh, my hair will be completely different. It will most likely be blonde all over. Um, anyway, so for now, I'm going to leave this episode here. If you have any like suggestions of like what to see or something in the video, like I I have seen this game played before, but I don't remember it. So I kind of don't really remember what's going on or, or anything like I'm not really aware of what's going to happen but anyways if you did like this video please click that like button down below and while you're there please click the subscribe button so you are told when my next Night in the Woods video has been uploaded. Bye!